why I said UM deserves the Product Excellence Award for IGV. Uh, let's look at the reality first. If you look at the criteria, where there's a number of realization, a percentage of commercial product accepted realized, um, MPS score, MPS uh, filling in rate, SNS completion, relative to absolute growth, we are not the best in Malaysia. Among all the single criteria, I don't think we are the best in Malaysia. But <clears throat> I'm quite confident in our relative growth and absolute growth. We may not be the best, but definitely we are one of the best there. And also, our SNS completion rate for winter is above 90%. And um, when we look at the bad factors, like example, given the MPN score, we don't actually have above 9 score, it's only 8.6. And uh, reason being is that one of it is because like uh, we are working mainly with NGO, especially in summer, Gen 6 realization in summer. And you, we can't really control what happens in the NGO. And a lot of times when NGO gives problems and despite we try to solve it, but it's still, in the end, when you work with NCL, a lot of decision comes from the NGO. And it's very, very difficult for us to control the experience. And thus, um, there will be bad experiences where we learn from it and then we stop collaborating with the NGO. But things have happened. So that's why our MPS score got pulled down. But also, our MPS filling in rate is not very high. Yes, and that is definitely a mistake from us for not emphasizing on that, for not ensuring that EP is filling in right after they go back, but we delayed it. And when we try to follow up, expire giving problem and when expire problem is solved, EP are really not responsive to us. That is definitely our mistake and I'm very clear with that. And if our entity is not able to win the award, that is definitely our drawback. And if you look at our realization number, it's not the highest. I think it's quite far from the highest also. So um, if our entity should win, it will definitely be more on our relative growth and our absolute growth and also our percentage of completion as an as and also um with i mean i myself as vp i felt that it was a quite an impressive effort by my team which has lacking of manpower to really achieve this number in the end and definitely if our entity deserve to win this award it will be because of the ability to thrive through this to achieve this number to achieve this growth despite the lacking of manpower. Yeah.